they will try to test you. But they fail to realize there's not one ounce of give up in your spirit. There's not one ounce of give up in your heart. There's not one ounce of give up in your soul. There's not one ounce of give up in your body. Baker Mayfield said, I woke up dangerous. But most people wake up aimless with no sense of direction. But not you. You wake up every morning on fire, ready to crush your day, ready to crush excuses, ready to dominate in your lane, ready to execute your goals. You know life is coming. You know life is trying to sucker punch you. You know life wants to break you. You know life wants to beat you down. But instead of frown, you just smile. Because you know there's not one ounce to give up in your soul. So you stand tall in the face of it all. Wipe the sweat from your brow. And keep grinding, and keep grinding because you will not be broken. You will not be moved. Like that tree that's planted by the water. You will not be moved. So you just hitting your stride, just getting into the groove. They thought they could break you. But there's not one ounce of give up in your body. And therefore, you keep running your race until you emerge victorious. And you understand that there will be moments when you want to throw in the towel. And that's when you tap into your inner greatness and go the extra mile. So every mile marker, you celebrate the small wins because you understand that the small wins lead to the big wins, lead to the gold balls, lead to the trophies, lead to the rings, lead to the riches, lead to the spoils, and you will never, ever, ever allow one mere mortal to foil your plans of achieving next level success. So when it gets hard, you giggle. When it gets tough, you laugh. Because you know the path to victory is paved with obstacles. It's paved with roadblocks. It's paved with uncertainties. But one thing is certain, your heart doesn't pump Kool-Aid. One thing that is certain, there is not one ounce of give up in your soul. There's not one ounce of give up in your heart. And so you keep fighting until the very end. This is a great day to win. Rise up, people. Rise up with a full heart. Rise up with an understanding. Rise up from the excuses. Rise up with the willpower. And understand that it's up to you to make a difference. Sometimes it gets tough. Sometimes you get to a point where you don't want to push yourself. Pushing the world is just a part of it. And sometimes the world can be very nasty. It can put you in a position where you don't understand what to do next. But I'm here to let you know, ladies and gentlemen, everything starts with you. Everything necessarily is not about you, but it definitely starts with you. If you're not willing to put the work in, if you're not willing to go a little bit higher, a little bit further and understanding that work is good. Prosperity is good. Success is good. Life is good. But these excuses always tend to show up in your life. This thing that you continue to hold on, this pity party that you continue to possess in your life tends to hold you back. But what are you gonna do? You're gonna to have to suffer sometime in your life. You're gonna to have to feel something sometime in your life. 
Why is it every time you wake up, you want to have something handed to you? Why can't you earn it yourself? Why do you feel like everybody owes you something? It starts with you. You got to be the one that wanted. You got to be the one to go after. You got to be the one to go further. You got to be the one to hurt just a little bit. So what? Maybe you don't like the situation you're in. Maybe you don't like the circumstances you're in. Then what are you gonna do about it? What are you gonna do? You're gonna cry? You're gonna wall around? Hope that somebody come rescue you from all of these things that you are dealing with in your life right now? You feel that everybody in the world is feeling sorry for you right now? You feel like everybody in the world owes you something? No one owes you anything. No one. You better start doing something. You better start doing something now. That's how it goes. That's what it is. That's the reality. Not sitting around hoping somebody to come and help you. Hoping that somebody gonna put their arms around you and tell you it's gonna be okay. You gotta make it okay. In fact, you gotta make it better than okay. You got to go beyond. You got to go up. You gotta go up those stairs. You gotta go up that mountain. You gotta do whatever it is that's gonna take to make you strong and better and more efficient. That's what you gotta do. Whatever it takes, whatever the know-how you have inside, don't let nothing, and I mean nothing, stop you. Nothing under the sun can control what's yours. Nothing under the sun can control what's already been written for you. You just gotta keep going up. So rise up every step. Rise up every opportunity. Rise up. When it gets higher, you get higher mentally. Rise up. You make it to the top. And when there's nothing else left to go up to, find something else to climb up. And yeah, you're gonna fall. Yeah, you're gonna stumble. Yeah, there's gonna be some mistakes on the way. But it doesn't mean that it's over. It means you got to keep living. It means you got to keep going. It means you got to keep believing. And find it. And go after it. Because success is not looking for you. Success ain't coming for you. You got to be the one to go after it. Choice is up to you. Make it happen and conduct your business. You only live once. So do what you feel passionate about. Take chances. Don't be afraid to fail. There's an old IQ test was nine dots and you had to draw five lines with a pencil within these nine dots without lifting the pencil. The only way to do it was to go outside the box. So don't be afraid to go outside the box. Don't be afraid to think outside the box. Don't be afraid to fail big, to dream big. But remember, dreams without goals are just dreams. And they ultimately fuel disappointment. So have dreams, but have goals, life goals, yearly goals, monthly goals, daily goals. I try to give myself a goal every day. Simple goals, but have goals. And understand that to achieve these goals, you must apply discipline and consistency. In order to achieve your goals, you must apply discipline and consistency every day, not just on Tuesday and miss a few days. You have to work at it. Every day, you have to plan. Every day. Hard work works. Working really hard is what successful people do. And in this text, tweet, twerk world that you've grown up in, <laughs> remember, just because you're doing a lot more doesn't mean you're getting a lot more done. Remember that just because you're doing a lot more doesn't mean you're getting a lot more done.